It will come as no surprise to you. I'd like to talk about what we need today to, to, uh, to raise the debt limit. And while the Republicans in Congress, are, what they're doing today is so reckless and dangerous, in my view. And raising the debt limit is usually a bipartisan undertaking, and it should be. That's what is not happening today. The reason we have to raise the debt limit is, in part, because of the reckless tax and spending policies under the previous Trump administration. In four years, they incurred, they'd incurred nearly $8 trillion. In four years, $8 trillion in additional debt. In bills, we have to now pay off. That's more than a quarter of the entire debt incurred now outstanding after more than 200 years. And Republicans in Congress raised the debt three times when Donald Trump was president, and each time with Democrat support. But now they won't raise it, even though they're responsible for more than $8 trillion in bills incurred in four years under the previous administration. That's what we'd be paying off. They won't raise it, even though defaulting on the debt would lead to a self-inflicted wound that takes our economy over a cliff. Not only are Republicans refusing to do their job, they're threatening to reuse the power, their power, to prevent us from doing our job, saving the economy from a catastrophic event. I think, quite frankly, it's hypocritical, dangerous, and disgraceful. Their obstruction and irresponsibility knows absolutely no bounds. <coughs> Meteor is headed, is headed to crash into our economy. Democrats are willing to do all the work stopping it. Republicans just have to let us do our job. Just get out of the way. If you don't want to help save the country, get out of the way so you don't destroy it. 